Hi, Gemini. It's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking. All right, let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Gemini with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see how you're coming to the reading, Gemini. All right, the King of Wands taking action, looking at the bigger picture, delegating. Uh, you could be an entrepreneur. You just do things on your own terms. You're very independent. Maybe you have like psychic abilities. You kind of tap into them from here and there, but you know, there's some unexpected money coming to you. Good luck, good fortune on your side. Some of you are really tied to your home right now. You just stay home. Five of Wands. Um, maybe there are people trying to get your attention. Your, you know, they want you to give them some attention, get your affection. Eight of Swords. Um, but maybe, I don't know, there might be even the energy of, um, you being mentally bound, hurt, needing to deal with some hurt. The Hermit card. Spending a lot of time by yourself. Trying to shift your philosophy about you, about your life, like. What hasn't been working for you? So what can you change about you? Yeah, four of cups, two of wands, a lot of energy of just changing you. Uh, emotionally withdrawn. Not, not placing the emotions where they actually should be. You kind of are kind of drawing everything in on you, being self-centered, not seeing that it's opportunity maybe for you to get out of this this tough emotional or mental space some of you trying to figure out something how to make a move with the nine i mean the two of wands here trying to find uh financial security between doing two different things also So you're trying to get somebody to make the move to maybe marry you or, yeah, marry you. Yeah, go to the next level. You want them to marry you. You want it. So this could be like someone saying they would marry you. Um, this could be a long engagement. But you want it to be made real. Queen of Pentacles. And you're wondering about the timing. Like, why is it so delayed or? Or other people wondering about that, like what's going on? Why no progression? Let's see what how how your person, whomever you're coming to the reading for, how they feel. All right. Queen of Pentacles paid so somebody feels like maybe there's there could be a, a wife or a girlfriend and a child. Someone feels like maybe somebody is materialistic about they're all about beauty and fashion someone feels like this is burdensome it's not real maybe that um they thought that you and they were like-minded individual but you you are not and that's why they're keeping something hung up it could come that it doesn't work out or it doesn't move it doesn't progress forward yep whatever this is it's like it doesn't go where you thought it was going to go or the person, yeah. They like quickly go to resolve something or like dissolve or they try to make it right, whatever they do. Yeah. But something is not going towards long term commitment. What is the advice for Gemini? Advice for Gemini. Advice for Gemini. Ten of Cups. Uh, call a truce within yourself, within a family dynamic. Um, stop being at odds with your person. Sun card. Uh, have more positivity. Be, be in that childlike spirit. Um, wake up on a positive note. Yeah, the high priestess. Uh, hold some things back. Don't make it all public. And the Eight of Cups, you know, analyze yourself and your own behavior so that you can be better. Temper your emotions and your outbursts. 
could be a new home or something like that or new love on the horizon for you. Make sure you, you don't feel like it's over between you and somebody else. An air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, you could be using children to kind of spy on them or get information or get the opportunity to reconcile with them. This is what I have for you. If it resonates, go over to the website, book there, ask a question or two by booking the one question, one answer at the website level. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.